Saint of the day. So today it's Saint Timothy. So on this blessed day of January the 26th, 2024, we honor and reflect upon the life of Saint Timothy, a revered figure in Christian history. Born in Lystria in Asia Minor, Saint Timothy was a close companion and disciple of Saint Paul, the Apostle. Today we commemorate his selfless dedication to spreading the teachings of Christ and his exemplary life of faith. Saint Timothy's story is not just one of a devout follower, but also of a young leader who embraced his responsibilities with unwavering commitment. It is said that from an early age, Saint Timothy displayed a deep sense of piety and genuine desire to serve the Lord. His journey with St. Paul was instrumental in shaping him into a formidable leader of the early Christian community. One notable aspect of St. Timothy's character was his humility and selflessness. Despite his youth, he played a crucial role in the missionary journeys of St. Paul, proving that age is no obstacle when one is guided by the Spirit. St. Timothy was entrusted with important tasks and responsibilities, reflecting his wisdom beyond his years. St. Timothy is often credited with the authorship of two books in the New Testament, and these epistles contain valuable guidance on matters of faith, leadership, and the conduct of the Christian community. His writings continue to inspire and guide believers to this day. In one of his profound statements, St. Timothy encapsulated the essence of his faith, saying, For God did not give up a spirit of timidity, but a spirit of power of love and of self-discipline. This timeless message serves as a beacon for Christians, urging them to embrace courage, love and self-discipline in their spiritual journey. So as we reflect on the life of St. Timothy today, let us offer a prayer of gratitude for his exemplary witness and ask for the strength to live our own lives in accordance with the teachings of Christ. May we, like Timothy, be filled with the spirit of power love and self-discipline, so that our lives may also be a witness to the glory of God. Amen. From a friend of Our Lady.